Welcome back to Imperion Galactic Survival version 1.5. I'm your host, Probability of Success Zero, and this is a continuation of our Series 6 playthrough. Now, before you do anything else, I'd really appreciate it if you did that like, subscribe, and notification icon so that you too can stay up to date with my content as it comes out. And also, if you're interested in seeing what happened previously, just check out the link in the top right hand corner of the screen. It'll include the previous episode as well as other playthrough series. Now, continuing on with our little ad, uh, little adventure with the Zerak. So, in the previous episode, we spent a great deal of time going through the Bombs Tower. Now, I'm not entirely sure where that is. We're just going to have a look at the planet. And, oh my god, we've teleported a very long way. So we were at this tower just here. We got teleported into the radar station. Uh, and now we've been teleported all the way around the planet to over here. Um, that is a very long distance. Um, I'm a little concerned because obviously our ship is technically still back on the ground where we left it. Um, we picked up some gold, we picked up a sniper rifle, an epic sniper rifle, so let's just uh, switch that over, because why the hell not? And um, so we picked up a couple of um, tier 2, sorry, epic weapons from that previous previous uh, little POI that we've done. I've sort of, I'm cheating a little bit right now, I have to confess. We've, we're really far up in the air. If I just get the drone out for a second, just just look how far up in the air we are, and we have nothing below us. And I just stepped in this elevator just here to kind of get out of the cold because check this out. I just noticed this, and this is really strange. Look at the temperature gauge. I stand here. It's minus 42, 5.5 rads. I step over here onto the, the glass. And immediately, 22 degrees, zero rats. And it's all because I'm standing on a sheet of glass. Very odd. So right now, this is actually considered uh, inside. So we're shielded from the elements. Quite an interesting quirk. Anyway, um, so the mission today is to go into this POI, which you can see is swarming with quite a few enemies, quite a few turrets. Um, yeah, so I'm not looking forward to this bit because I think I'm going to get absolutely shredded. And we've got to access the mainframe. So this is part of a very long-winded series of missions for the storyline. So we're going to crack on and do that now. I've got to be careful though because if, if I just remember... Yeah, you can hear them teleporting in. Oh, we've got mechs now. There's mechs inside. Great. So let's get drone up again. Yeah, there's a turret up there. It's a turret. Yeah, and he just shot our drone. Right, there's a gravity generator there as well. I'm just going to fly around there. Let's do a bit of recon while, while we can. So there's the door in. Oh, it's just so many bad guys in there. There's quite a few lootables as well from what I can see. Oh, is the mech going to fall out the window? No, no, he's two in there. Right, okay, I think we've done a bit enough recon. Let's just track on and get in here. I'm going to stand at the edge here. Yep, and immediately we've got a bad guy coming up. Let's see if we can use this uh, new rifle of ours. Okay, can't reload that, uh, I'm going to save that for later. There's another guy back there. Right, he's down. Oh. He's down. 
Right, just going to heal ourselves quickly. <sighs> So we've reached level 15 as well, so that's a bonus. Two... Two robots down there. Got to be careful, because it's too... The coil on this board is awful. I think we may have cleared it. I think we've done it. Cleared that floor. Oh, okay. Yeah. Lots of hostiles. Got him. Oh, running shot. He's down. Oh, running shot again. So there's obviously a turret round here. There's a turret. Oh, turret's up. Right. Bandage up again. Is there a healing pod here? I don't think there will be because this is not really designed for that. That's down. Should be alright. Think that's it for this section. There's a medical station, but not a healing pod. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, we'll just loot these guys before we despawn. I think we've grabbed everything. Yeah, so it's up the elevator now. I think we need to done this. Look around because it's got to be something lootable here. Yeah. Hmm. Nope, it's not going to do anything. Oh, I'm feeling there's something behind there. Right, so the next bit's going to be interesting. Oh, there's a floor below us. There was a floor below us. on. Can we slip through that? Yeah, we can. Oh, oh. Ow.
Oh, right in the spine. Sorry, mate. You weren't facing the right way. You're a bad robot. Oh, there's one. He's down. Patch ourselves up. <sighs> I do love my epic shotgun. Oh, got a mech over there. Let's just grab this guy. Uh, it's just tickling it at the minute. That was a level four robot as well. That's why it was uh, not blowing with a single shot. We ah, oh, it's despawned. Right, there's a lever there. Hmm. What could the lever do? And it's right over something marked in hazard. Hmm. Uh, I wanna I want to pull it. <laughs> I'm just I'm just afraid it might do something unexpected like drop me out the floor. He's just gone through the floor. Yeah, he has. That's a bit crap. Uh, can we get to this guy? I don't think we can actually. I think they're outside. No. Oh well, never mind. There are some medical stations here, we just can't use them. Okay, that's that floor done. Just check out the other side again. Make sure there's nothing wrong with that. I think that's it for this. Yeah, I better put a torch on so we can actually see. Would it help? That's it. Uh, got that. Ooh, last bit, I suspect. So that's where we came in. Right, I'm not seeing any hostiles there. What? What? Should look behind me, says me right. Oh, bloody hell, two guns. Can we snipe from it? Yeah, well, I think we can. Stan, that's the other one. There he is. Oh, 
Push ourselves up. Shotgun time. Leg it. Grab that. Give me access? No. Oh, there's an epic. Well, there's a container. I see a second one further down. Nice, but we're maxed. So we can throw that in there. There's the stuff we can just throw out. Nano tubes. We don't care about that. Steel plates. Don't care about that. Um. Mm. Computers, do we really care? Probably not, trash that. Mechanical parts, trash that. Electronics, trash that. Optical uh, cable, trash that. Uh, we'll keep the rest. Alright, okay. That gives us a bit more room. See two containers down there. Yeah, I'm being super cautious now because I've not seen anything spawn in on this level and I'm a bit suspicious as to why. Oh, this is. Why is there nothing coming through? No gun net. Nope, that's it. I think that's all the hostiles on this level. Huh. Okay, we're definitely, we don't care about that. Projectile pistol, get rid of that. Um, copper. Mechanical drill. Uh, alien plasma. Ooh, what's in the other one? Ah, oh, we, we've got to teleport back, haven't we? Right. So guys, I'm going to have to just jump back to, to uh, unload some of this stuff. So that should take us to the radar station. I'm hoping we can go back again. Be sucky if we couldn't. All right, so if we do that, that'll take us to the comms array. Okay, this will be quick. And then we've got to go all the way through the facility to get back to that spawn point. Right, we're just going to check on the ship because it's been a while. It's not blown up, that's good. Okay, let's just access the... Ooh, what happened there? Something just bumped us. Oh, it's thrown into the ammo bay. Ah, oh, that's fair enough. Uh, sniper. Not too fussed about that. Let's just quickly have a look. And from the scanner. There's something 500 meters away. Nothing approaching. It's a 440. I think we should still be all right. Let's look over there. Yeah, we're fine.
Right, here we go. We're back. Wasn't that long, was it? Just, just make sure we've grabbed everything. Don't see any other epic containers or anything around here. So... We've done this floor. Yeah, so it's this one. Okay. Okay, I'm confused. Where's the... Oh, okay, that, that'll come in handy. Ultra rare. So it says release information. Release information from where? Is there a console somewhere? The only thing around is this. Right, we're going to have to pull it on to... Here we go. What does it say? Just one sentence. Glad you are here, Alex. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, quick, run, 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 run. Quick, 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 leg it, leg it, just leg it, quick, 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 and leg. Surprise! You cheeky blighters! Nice. Uh, although no coordinates, no flight vector. Great. At least uh, the Grand and most of the fleet survived this ambush. Okay. And the Zirat don't know where they went. Okay. That is good to know. Yeah, hopefully that didn't just screw him over either. I have a good feeling about this, he says. Hmm, do you now? <laughs> I don't. Right, okay. Take a break. For now, let's get the hell out of here. I agree, Ida. I agree. Incoming message, okay. You code in? Right, okay. Priority message. Just had a sip of coffee. Uh, long story short, we had the Polaris officials have lost uh, one of the capital ships. Right. Right, uh, and with we, you actually mean me, correct? Yes, he does. <laughs> I did volunteer. Sure thing. Okay. Right. Let's get the hell out of it. 
Alrighty then, so we've got quite a few goodies out of that station. A uh, bit of gold, a couple of epic weapons, uh, large optotronic. Yeah, we're, we're, we're doing alright now. We're doing alright. Uh, it's hail, so we've got to be careful while going outside. Top of my air, so I think we can leave this planet now, can't we? To, oh, ouch, he says about got to be careful because of the hail. Right. Okay then. Did we go and have a look at that crash shuttle? Ah, oh, I can't be bothered. Right, I just want to get home. It's been a long day. Right, let's take off. Can we take off? No, because I've not put thrusters on. Uh, we've got a bit of fuel still. Let's just top that up because we need to make sure uh, it's not that one we're looking at. Throw everything into there for now. Make go. Come on, cargo bay, fridge bay. Ooh, we've got a fridge, forgot about that. Ah, spoiled food. All right, trash. Got any more food? I don't think we do other than that. We're gonna just eat all of that. All the rest of it's rotten or rotted. One last bit. There we go. And let's go back to play it. We're going to grab that hot drink and we're going to leave it there. Um, yep. Not left anything behind. Nothing of value anyway. Uh, oh yes, we did need to top up the fuel a bit. Uh, maybe we should use a large one. Let's see how many large. Uh, only four, that'll do. And what we'll do is climb out loud, come on. Throw that back across. Right, so we're taking off. Bye bye, Snow Planet. It was nice for a visit. We might come back to plunder your resources. But for now, we are heading back into space. And my god, we're towing some weight now. And there we go. So once we're in space, I'm going to take the space break off. So we're at max speed. I'm going to run scanner again. It's Polaris ship. We've got no problems going on with that now. So we can jump back home. Locking onto the home planet and warp. I do like the fact you can walk with shields now. That makes travel so much safer. Although it does take that slight element out of it of risk, which I thought was quite interesting because coming out of warp and then having an enemy ship just there was kind of thrilling because you had to like take evasive maneuvers and get out of there and try and get shields active. Oh, okay. <laughs> we nearly collided with the um, the ring as we're coming back. Oh, that does look good. Home sweet home. The question is, where the hell? Oh, hang on. Where the hell is my base in relation to all of this? We'll find out in a second. Got a feeling it's. Uh, well, I know it's along the equator somewhere. 
We'll find out where it is in a moment. Come on, there we go. Space brakes on. And run the scan. There, it's only 5k away. I think we can survive that. So that has been a pretty rewarding um, mission that has. We've got a medium suit of armor, a load of boosters, we've got a couple of epic devices. That's epic sniper rifle, epic shotgun. We've managed to pick up a large optotronic bridge. That absolute ton load of stuff. And we've learned quite a bit about the Zero. They really are buggers. So once we get to our base, I can uh, drop this pod off and unload it. I might actually drop it in our in our um, lower docking bay, the one that's subterranean. Just keep it safe for now. I'm sure where I'm going to put the fight on. Right, let's just have a quick look. Can we actually get over there? Oh, this is going to be interesting. I don't think we're going to be able to get, get in there. Nope. <laughs> right. Um, right, so where's the entrance? It's over there. about this since so I've got a pod down. Uh, a little bit off the ground because of how this works. Okay. Jump into the sea and all I've got to do is do that and then on the ground. Oh, I see the problem. Got no fuel. So problem, just grab. Uh have we got like the smallest amount of fuel? Yeah we have. So all I've got to do is literally drop. There we go. And turn off. Oh, it's rolling. Fantastic. Go on, straighten up. I, I have no idea what's going on here. It's, it's moving by itself. Okay, don't worry about that. We'll just try and get out now. And glitchiness bizarre absolutely bizarre okay and then we can just land the fighter there we go and all off okay Jesus I don't know what's going on with that so on this side we just get the cargo bay and oh, what I'll do is I'll just move everything across and then I'll go back to here switch over to the fridge and I'll start moving the fridge items across which is pretty much all of these and I'll throw that across as well then we'll switch over to the uh, ammo bay, pardon me. And we'll just move all the ammo. And we'll move the 
boosters and the armor as well. That's pretty much everything. Oh, I've got some of them. I think that should be enough. Oh yeah, that's got to go in the fridge as well. Water. That's a luxury item. Technical artifact. Right, okay. Play up. So what we're gonna do What else have we got? Oh that's weapons. Move that across. Not that. That and that. Biofuel we'll leave that there. Yeah, we'll move that across. That's a handheld device. Right. So. There we go. So let's try and figure out what's going on with this bloody thing. Switch it on. And. There we go, it's corrected. I think it's because it was underneath the ship. There we go. We've been catapulted out, that's fine. Pick up the hatch. can stay right there. Right. So that's been a pretty hard little mission. Let's just jump down here and sort ourselves out quickly. So, um, no, not, yeah, no, it's this way. We need to get some O2 on our system. Go over it, get ourselves healed up. There we go. Let's have a look at the fridge. Uh, get ourselves a nice duty burger. And that heal, a little bit of health. What's gonna, yeah, we'll eat a vegetable. That'll do it. Uh, top our bandages up. We've got for quite a few of them. Throw them back in. Ooh, hang on. Because we're now using laser rifle. So we've got that. I'm going to take some laser rifle rounds with me. Ah. Oh, okay. <laughs> and that's a good way to end the episode. The Zeraka attacking. Right, so. Uh, we haven't got shields. We'll just leave the weapons on. We've got the tank. So we're going to run over it and put the tank on. Where's these bad boys coming from? Yeah, we'll move to intercept. Come on, boys. Come on, do your worst. Come on. Come on. <gasps> That's it, got them all. Yeah, I think the turret took a few hits. But that's okay. Just park up here again. Come on, get up there. I don't think we took any damage then. Hopefully we didn't. Not on the tank at least. Power off. Uh, let's quickly get the mud tool out. Repair. Any damage on it? 
Nah. Get more on the base. Oh, we lost two solar panels. Great. Okay. Joy. Right, that's not too bad to be fair. Can potentially build a shield generator for the base now, so I'm probably going to invest in one of them. Let's just go and get the loot. There's the other one. That's over there. Third one about. Let's get the drone above the cloud, uh, cloud, the tree top, so I can actually see. Can't see where the third drone went. Right. So that's one, that's two. Took, took him out back here a bit. Oh well, no mind. Oh, there he is. side so then my way put that into the cargo bay no on my bay right so everything is Good in the world again right so I think I'm gonna call the episode an end just there guys we've done quite a bit we've got the information from the mainframe we looted the hell out of it we managed to get the fighter and all the cargo we collected back from the snowy planet and then we've successfully defended our base now I do need to do some off-camera repairs and upgrades to the base and then uh, in the next episode we'll, we'll think about what we're going to do because we've got a couple of options now um, it's clear that we're going to have to go on another mission but I do want to kind of get things up and running at the base as well so there might be a couple of projects I might decide to undertake before we start that other mission so for now thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next episode in a bit.